the largest economy on earth, the land of opportunity, and yet too many children are going hungry in America. It's a big problem in this country. I'm telling you, a lot of kids come to school hungry, and it affects everything. You're not going to be productive if you're hungry. The United States has one of the highest child poverty rates in the industrialized world. One in five children here now rely on food stamps. And right here in Bridgeport, Connecticut, it is double that, 40%. The desperation in a city like Bridgeport is intense. Children get up in the morning, many of them don't have food. Their grades and their ability to focus plummet when they're not having adequate nutrition. We want to live in a society where we take care of our children. I think most Americans would agree with that. I don't like my neighborhood. There's always going to be need in, in a low-income neighborhood. It has to stop somewhere. I don't want them to struggle. It's an important part of our culture to feel like we're giving all children a chance to be successful. Oh, you got to work a lot to get just a chance. This is their reality. We should step into their shoes so that we can understand them. That's why we need to go there and see what's going on. So we did. We followed a family as their children ate breakfast and lunch in school for free, as 19 million other children do nationwide. We saw how these lunches are made with limited resources and strict guidelines. We went shopping with their single mom on a food stamp budget, where healthy food is hard to come by or afford. We had dinner with them at home. It's all happening in one of the wealthiest counties in the country, in one of the wealthiest states, Connecticut. This is the story of how we feed our most vulnerable children for only a few dollars a day. What kind of society is this? Is this America?